Hey everybody, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. We're constantly updating it with new content and never seen before content. So if you want to get the latest from Harvest, hit the subscribe button. Uh, no one's going to take the mark of the beast accidentally. Because in fact, as we study scripture, we realize it's not just taking the mark on your right hand or forehead. It's a pledge of allegiance to the Antichrist himself. No one is going to take it by accident. And by the way, the Antichrist will not be revealed until the rapture of the church. So if you know who the Antichrist is and you think you know what the mark of the beast is, congratulations, you miss the rapture. Now I'm being facetious, of course, because we don't know. So the point is, it's pointless to try to identify Antichrist or even the mark that he will use. Let me summarize. The mark of the beast is future, not past or even present yet. The mark is a visible, literal brand of sorts. The mark will be given as a sign of devotion to Antichrist and as a passport to commerce. And here's the thing, you'll know it when you're getting it. There's even an angel that is gonna fly through the heavens warning people to not take the mark. So no one's gonna do it again by accident. So don't freak out if you go to Disneyland and they put a stamp on your right hand. It's okay, you have not taken the mark of the beast.